Hello everyone, um, as you can see here, I have some photo cards laid out here and it's going to be a different kind of video today, but I'm definitely excited because I've seen this go around on the internet and I guess definitely wanted to give it a try. Um, so it's quarantine time and I really don't have anything else to do. So this is really what we're going to do is show off these beautiful photo cards and I'm going to show off my bias from each K-pop group's one of their favorite cards. Yeah, I'm, I'm bad at explaining guys, sorry, but um, very excited because I have um, not a lot of cards in here, but there's some really cute cards in here, as you can see, and we'll definitely go ahead and just talk about them. Um, yeah, <laughs> there's gonna be a lot of rambling in here, so be prepared. So here we have our stack of cards. Um, I organized them in a way where it was like the least amount of albums I have to like the most. So the ults are definitely in the back and um, newer groups I'm trying to collect are in the front as you can see. And I did do some alpha alphabetized and stuff but hey it's it's whatever and I think it's it's, it's gonna be okay. So yeah these are all the cards I have. They are biases and bias records so I do collect in some groups two members. Um, some groups I don't only collect one because I can't really decide on the second. And I, uh, my wallet can't afford that so <laughs> I guess without really a further ado we just should go ahead and talk about the cards. So yeah let's go ahead and do that. So I'll move these out of the way. So the first card we have here is BX from CIX. I um, definitely just got into CIX so this is really the only card I have of him. But I find this actually very adorable because he's just so cute and yeah, <laughs> he's just, I love his, he's even like pouting a little bit, like I don't know. And his like eyes are so pretty and he's such a handsome man. So yeah, I just started standing and um, definitely want to get the next album of theirs. So maybe I'll pull another BX in the future. But this is the only BX card I have at the moment and... Like I said, it's very adorable. I'm glad it was one of my pulls. So we'll go ahead and put that card away. Next we have um, Ryujin from Itzy. Uh, she is... I don't know. I don't know. I have two I collect in Itzy, but she, I think right now she's my bias wrecker. Um, I just, I love this era so much and I love her pink hair. And it's just really, I'm glad I pulled this card. She's just really killing it. And it's like these backs of the cards are so pretty too. Like, JYP really stepped up for this one. But she's so pretty and I love her. And her new hair and um, the newest album is really pretty too. Like, she can pull anything off, I feel like. So that's that card. I just love it, honestly. And she has like a little ice cube with her. I think that's what it is because it's icy, but... You know, it's cute. <laughs> Next we have the actual bias of Itzy, and that's Yeji. And uh, once again, I think it's like the similar card, but it's like the backing is really cute, and she's just really pretty. I love it Yeji so much. Like, I don't know, like I got into Itzy, and then Yeji was just really the one that was like calling my name. So once again, I love the cards and stuff. The colors, the purples and the blues are just so pretty. Also, the um, Icy is the only albums I have of Itzy and plan on getting the next album, but it's just finances right now, you know? But yes, we love this card. We love her braids. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. The next card we have is Yuta from NCT 127, or just, you know, in general. Um, I love this card because he's so cute with his little smile and his hair is long and it's like the little band it's just a cute selfie of his and like the back is really bright <laughs> and unfortunately this is the only um yuta card i have in my possession at the moment but he's definitely adorable um honestly the other card is cute too but i think i would have chosen this one anyway um yeah nct is just one of those groups i just got into so i'm trying to like slowly collect but it's hard because you know quarantine is making me stand a whole lot of groups and i i'm not here for spending all my money but you know what my wallet is 
Well, it can't control me at this point. <laughs> so let's go ahead. But yeah, love this card. Love his face. He's so cute. Yuta is the only one I collect in NCT at the moment because he's just so handsome and so cute. I love them all. I do, I do. It's just Yuta is my baby bias. So next we have um, Baekhyun. He is not my um, bias from EXO or Super M, but... Um, Super M is one of those groups where I can't really choose a bias even though Taemin is pretty much the only one that's my bias, but I'm with the Super M I just decided I was just going to choose one card that I like the most and as much as I love the Taemin card I do have, I do really love this card of Baekhyun because his gray hair is really iconic and you know this black shirt is just, it looks so good on him. He's just a general cutie. I mean. We love a puppy dog. <laughs> and then, yeah, and then I think is, yeah, and I love how he like wrote Sarang, Sarangeo Moko Sita on the back. I don't know, it's just, this is the cutest card ever. I mean, they're all so cute, but like this one is just really my favorite out of the bunch that I do have. And really, Super M is a group that I am collecting OT7 for for some reason, so really it was hard to choose who my bias is, even though, Ta like I said, Taemin is my actual bias from Shiny, but, you know, I don't know. So I chose this Baekhyun card because it's just super cute. So next we move on to Twice. I do collect two members. Jiho is technically my bias record, but she's pretty high up there. Um, and I chose this card because Fancy You was really her era. I feel like, not like, well... I don't know, Fancy U was just an era in general. I just feel like she just really pulled off that era. But like, yes, and this really cute like wink face she's giving and it's just, she looks so adorable. It was really hard to choose one because like I was gonna look at one for feel special but like, she, it's just, it's, it's hard to choose a good photo card for her because she's so pretty and like so cute and it's hard to choose but this was definitely one of my favorites and I just decided to choose this one because she is adorable with her little winky face and I love her. I love a queen. I love Queen Jiho. Next one we have is my actual bias for twice and that's Cheong. Um, I chose her feel special card because I found this one really cute and adorable because she's like got a diamond in front of her and she's trying to eat it. I don't know. It's just, it's cute and it's, it feel special was a good era for her as well and her long hair. So yes, we love it. We love it, and it's just, I love her. She's just so cute in general. So I don't know, man, I don't know. We love her, so we'll put her back. Also, by the way, if I start brushing, my camera battery is dying, die, dying, dying as usual. So we're gonna try to not rush, but if it's an awkward cutoff, you know why. Next, um, I dif had a different card for Yuto at first, but this one just came into the mail today. And I found this very adorable. It's a pre-order card, um, so it's not technically an album photo card, but I couldn't choose. I didn't have a lot of Yuto photo cards, so this one is definitely probably one of my favorites because he's squishing his face so adorably. And he's got painted nails, and I don't know, Black Hall was such an iconic era. Like, we love, we love it, we love it. And it's just, I think he's got even like, like eye makeup on like his uh, there's a highlight right there it's like really pretty I don't know this is just this just card came in today and I was just I fell in love honestly I could not say no to that <laughs> the next card we have is Hong Joon um he is one of the two I collect in ATs and he is definitely a bias wrecker um but he's also very much up there honestly all of ATs are big bias wreckers and it was hard for me to choose a bias for the longest time but yes we love our leader nim um he is so cute i love this was from the answer to action collection and he's just like we love hand gestures and we love winky faces and we just love that smirk and he's just an all-around cutie and i could not resist like we love hong joon it's just and the back's so pretty too because look at this blue shiny color and it's just I don't know it's a really cute card his hair is also very pretty and he pulls it off well I love Hong Joon so much you guys so much but I'm glad I have this card and I have the action to answer collection complete 
Next, we have the actual bias of ATs, and that's my boy Sangwa. Um, I didn't. Ha I don't have a lot of ATs cards, but if I'm being honest, Treasure was really like his era. I mean, look at his freaking hair. And then this was the first card I traded for him too. So really, this like look in general really kills me. And he's even biting his lip. Like who? asked you to do so like i don't know but he's my bias for a reason as you can see but we also love a um a mother of the group <laughs> but he's so cute we love his black hair and like treasure was the era that got me into ets i don't know ets was just a group i was trying to get into but when this era this era dropped it like really got me into it so we love it we love it and it just He's such a hand and the turtleneck i love turtlenecks like who wouldn't love turtlenecks next card we have is mark he um i don't know god seven was one of those groups where it was hard to choose because i really don't have a lot of photo cards of them because i struggle at collecting god seven but i really love this card because it's just like his eyebrows look so good and his hair looks so good and that shirt looks so good on him like who could not resist this card? Like, and I don't know, it's just like a whole look put together. And I have a secret weakness for men with strong eyebrows. And like, Mark, you are definitely having strong eyebrows. And like, he's even pouting a little bit. Like, how cute. And it's just, Spinning Top was a good era, honestly. And I, like I said, I really don't have a lot of GOT7 photo cards, but this one is just to die for, if we're gonna be honest. I love this card so much. He is also the bias wrecker, so <laughs> yes, we love it. Next we have the actual bias of GOT7 and that's Bam Bam. Um, he was also another one to hard to choose for because like, I don't have a lot of Bam Bam cards that really stand out, but this one is just, I find this one really cute because like his, his jacket, his suit jacket was really cute and he's doing this little like hand gest- I like hand gestures for some reason and like his hair in this era killed me so this is giving you a full shot of that and like i don't know he just really pulled off this era let's be honest in the back call my name was a good gray era you guys like i don't in their recent comeback i don't know they just keep stepping up each comeback they have and i just i just i think this one's my favorite out of all and because he just looks so cute and like i love him i love him so much so next we move on to EXO. This is one of the two EXO cards that I chose today, and this is Chan Yul's card. Um, Chan Yul isn't one I have a lot of cards for, unfortunately, but this is probably the cutest one I do have. And it's his little, like, filter on his face, and I just- his eye makeup and his gray hair, and like, Don't Mess Up My Tempo was a great era as well. But like, I don't know, it's just- it's also like one of the only few I have and it's just this one just stood out to me the most because he's just smirking and he's cute and he's like doing his usual business as Chun Yul. So we love, we love, we love a filter king. We do. Um, yeah, we love him. Lighting is darker, but that is because it is a few hours later and the video cut. So that's fun. I will continue from where I last left off. So next we have this Seiyun card, and um, I was saying before I was so rudely interrupted, if y'all didn't know this was my favorite Seiyun card ever, then you must be blind, because I am in love with this card, especially his little dumb, dorky little face, and I pulled this card, and I was so happy that I pulled this card. It's just like the cutest thing ever, and like, let's just get a closer look, because like, look, he's just being a dork, and that's just why I love him, but like... Obsession was a good era, and like he really snapped this era too. I don't know, man. It's just I am in love with this card. I would display it if I could, but it is gonna be nicely packed away in my binder to show off that way. But yes, this is my favorite of that one. And so now we move on to the ult of ults, and it is my boy Taeyong. Um. <laughs> He is the literal love of my life. Um, he is also like, I don't know. I could never, I could never get enough of him. It was literally hard choosing a card for this one, but this one was like, this one is like literally probably everyone's favorite. But um, 
yeah he is the cutest bean of all time um we love this card because it is, has hearts on his face his orange hair it's more pink but you know on camera from it looks it says orange but whatever um yeah and it's so cute i love love yourself answers like backing it's like rainbow holographic it's beautiful and oh my god yeah i <laughs> I couldn't just, it was so hard to choose because, like, he's the love of my life. Uh, um, yeah. Also, I was, don't have two cards for BTS. I mean, two members, but, um, a little announcement. I am trying to slowly collect Yoongi, which is probably going to be the death of me because he is probably just as expensive as the Maknae line. But, um, yeah. <laughs> this is my favorite Taeyeon card if no one guess this then who do you think you are <laughs> so that is that one love of my life <laughs> so we do have an extra Taeyong card here and um both of the love yourself tour photo cards were my favorite but like i chose this one and i didn't give other extra ones to the other ones because i don't have like i don't collect extra stuff for them because i spent a lot of money on bts <laughs> But this card and the other Love Yourself um, tour card, which I might just put right here to show off, are the two of the cutest photo cards ever. And if I, I don't know, I spent an arm and a leg getting those two, but like, this is just the cutest thing ever. Especially how like, he's up close and like his pouty little baby face and we just, and look how adorable this is. Like... <laughs> And I had to spy money for this because one of them didn't come with a photo card because I bought it off eBay. But the other one, I pulled gin, and unfortunately no one trades gin for Taeyong, especially if it's a card like this. But this is the cutest card. Um, I did also just get the fifth muster, and the Taeyong card and that one would have probably also been my favorite, but um, it's not here yet, so yeah. <laughs> but this one is definitely the winner because he is the cutest love of my life, baby boy. Ever. We just love him. And he is. This is probably my most prized possession, if we're being honest. Yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and secure him back. This isn't bothering me. So that is all of my cards. So I'm gonna cut to a scene where they're just all displayed on the ground here. Yes. So that was my favorite photo cards from each bias video. Unfortunately, there wasn't a lot because there isn't a lot of groups that I fully collect yet, but I am slowly working on it. So maybe in a few months time or like a year from now, I will do another video like this and you'll see how my collection has grown. I don't know. Or how my opinions changed because yeah. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed these beautiful photo cards. Or maybe um, comment or subscribe or something like that. Um, yeah, that is all I have for you today. Um, please have a good day. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you later. Bye!